Hey everybody, how you doing today? It's Master Wanish here, and I just wanted to bring up something real quick as we're entering the new year, and that's just a bit of Wing Chun Kung Fu concepts and principles that you can apply into your everyday life. Once again, there's so many aspects of Wing Chun, and if you just utilize them in your fighting, you're leaving a lot of things just for fighting that you can use to enhance every aspect of your life, make you a better parent, friend, family member, better in relationships, better at your work, whatever it is you want to do, you can increase those things by using these Wing Chun concepts and principles, not just in your fighting, but applying them in your everyday life. And one of those things I want to talk about today is not fighting force against force. You're going to hear me talking about this a lot because in Wing Chun, we don't utilize strength for techniques because we always assume, and I don't even like that word technique, but we assume our attackers are gonna be bigger, stronger weapons and friends. Therefore, using something with brute strength to escape somebody choking you and have, have to rely on brute strength, it's never gonna work if they're bigger and stronger. If the person's bigger and stronger than me and they throw a punch and I try some forceful block, my arm's gonna bounce off their punch and I'm gonna get hit in the face. It's not gonna work. So applying force against force and using brute strength just doesn't work. And that's why we talk about economy of movement, economy of energy, doing the simplest thing within the realm of your safety. So in your everyday life, don't fight force against force. When you're dealing with somebody at work and you're butting heads, sidestep that negative energy and see how you can use your Kung Fu to be a problem solver and fix the problem. If you're butting heads and relationship, do what you can to sidestep that negativity that's happening at the moment, the struggle that's happening, the force that's happening, sidestep that and see if you can repair things. And sometimes you have to step out of your shoes, and you've heard this before, and put yourself in somebody else's shoes to see it maybe I'm seeing things one way and they're seeing things another. So when you can kind of do that, you can let go of your ego, let go of the attitude and become a problem solver, which is something we highly, highly do in Wing Chun at all costs. We want to solve problems as fast as possible in combat. We want to end this problem as fast as possible, solve it in the most simple, most effective way possible. So apply these concepts and principles to your everyday life. Don't fight force against force economy of movement, economy of energy, doing the simplest things within the realm of your safety. And it can make you better at your business, better at every aspect of your life. So these are just a few tips. I got my little one sleeping back there, so that's why I'm being a little bit quiet. And I got my other little one here doing some snow sledding or tubing, whatever you call it. And I just wanted to reach out, say hey, because I want to be more active on this channel. And while I'm with them, I figure I could give you some time as well and I hope to see you soon. Please take a second, hit that like, hit that subscribe, hit that bell notification so you don't miss out on any future videos to come. Thank you so much, have a wonderful day, and I wish you and yours a happy and healthy 2020. Let's make this a great year. Talk to you soon.